All right, guys, this is a bit of a quick one. Um, letting people know you're not dead. Not on about relatives. I'm on about the, uh, the tax authorities. In the UK, they do a document which is called a uh, life certificate. You just do a gov.uk search for life certificate and you'll find it. Because um, I know a lot of you people don't even register where you are on the planet. Um, it's important that at least you register on the gov.uk website because they can actually, you can do a lot of stuff in there. Um, HMRC and everything, a lot of it's on there. Um, now, if you do have to fill in one of these, because they do actually ask you to fill in the form now and again just to confirm you're not dead. Um, when you do it, when you send it in, make sure it's recorded delivery and you have a receipt for that delivery because these guys are getting notorious for not receiving things. Um, sorry, let me rephrase that. They're getting notorious for lying, in my personal opinion, that they're not receiving things. Um, what they're doing is actually delaying a lot of stuff because if they delay it, it generates more money in the economy in the sense that they haven't paid it. Now, if you think three or four months of everybody's pensions and all this sort of stuff by constant delaying, because obviously they're all being processed at different times, how many millions is that that suddenly just generates out of thin air, the economy looks a little bit better, but it's actually delayed payments. So bear that in mind. Get everything recorded and then follow it up. Give them a call. Have you confirmed? Can you confirm that you received this document on the 28th? Blah, blah, blah. It was received at 8 a.m. by Mrs. Jones. Uh, sorry. This is uh, this is the government offices. There's no way somebody's there at 8 a.m. Okay. At 10.45, um, can you confirm Mrs. Jones has received this document? And she signed for it and you have it. And they'll go, no. I can't confirm that, which has just happened to somebody I know. Um, even though they've received it, they're saying they can't find it. But the point is, once you have that signature and signed it over, the obligation is on their side because they have received it and they have been receiving a lot of paperwork and pretending they haven't got it. Um, it's just a mess. I mean, I'm not. I know some of this. I guess, and I do say guess, as I wouldn't. Have, I'm hesitant to say it's been done in purpose, but I do think so. Um, the The reality is that they're delaying a lot of things that involve payments and processing, etc. Because if you can't prove you're not dead, then they may hold your pension back, which is why this is an important one. Make sure they know who you are, where you are, and you're still alive. Um, they sell out, send out these self-assessment forms, but ultimately you need to make them aware how to contact you because I know a lot of you may have a house in the UK or whatever doesn't mean you always get your mail and a lot of these government services don't send email they do it in snail mail to make sure they know where you are um, so just bear that in mind thanks for watching